Hi, this is J2 here, and on this video, I'm just going to be talking about my computer freezing problem and the step I did to actually fix the problem. So basically, I mean, more like lately, I've been having computer freezing problem. So of course, it has to be a software or hardware problem. So I, of course, I went straight to taking a, taking a look at the hardware first. So what I did was pop open the case and of course inside was hella dusty so what I did was vacuum and blow everything up to clean the case. And then the next thing I did was actually um, to, uh, taking a look at the CPU and the RAM. So what I did was, I mean the RAM was first, so what I did was um, did a mem test on it and of, of course the RAM still running good, no error, nothing wrong with the RAM. So the next thing was the CPU. And then what I did was actually remove the fan and the heat sink from the CPU itself and replace the thermal grease with a new one and put it back on. And it turned out that the computer still freeze. So the next thing I did was um, take a look at the hard drive. And what I did was clean out the hard drive and the registry you no know, clean up to fix any of the registry that was on the hard drive. And the computer still freeze. Then I thought about it. All right, why is the computer freezing? And I noticed that the computer freezes a lot, especially when um, I'm doing anything with the internet or especially when I'm working with the network. So I was like, all right, then let me just test the um, network adapter. So what I did was took a look at the um, PCI network adapter, took that out and replaced it with a USB network adapter. And then of course I turned back on and the computer didn't have the freezing problem. And then of course I tried uploading stuff online, back and forth downloading, and it's not freezing anymore. So basically I have a um, faulty network adapter. And that's all I have to replace to fix the freezing problem.